are gonna start the next part of Toy Story 2. So yeah, let's just get right into it. Just gotta boot it up. Get the thing up. Okay. Run the game. And boom. We're gonna go to Elle's penthouse and fight Stinky Pete maybe, I think. And um, probably Zerg this time. I know I said that last time, but I didn't think I would run into so many complications on the last stream, so. Oh, cool. The safe state isn't working. Again. Well, at least I have my save file. Oh, there it goes. Okay. We're starting now. We're on our penthouse. So let's just get right into it. That's pretty noisy. I skip most of the emotional bonding with Winnie and them. Like, we don't know. Okay, what about the freaking clone bus? Wait. Oh no, he still has the belt on. Are they gonna explain that? I don't want to use my head. It's like the best, one of the best parts. Al's funny, I like him. Oh, Bullseye. Bruh, this music. Holy crap, we just got a like full on like cowboy music. I mean, it works, but like, it sounds so raw. I didn't expect to enter Al's penthouse and then hear the most raw music in existence. Holy crap. This is fire. I'm just so shocked. Gotta turn that up. Bullseye cannot talk. Boy, okay. Actually, I think the original plan... I think they actually originally wanted Bullseye to talk, but then they made him more dog-like. So maybe this is just a remnant of the movie being made, actually. I don't know. Might have been a late movie change. Howdy, Buzz. If you could bring me five horseshoes before you run out of time, I'll give you a Pizza Planet token. Oh, crap. Are you kidding me? It's another one. Okay. It's been a while since done one of these things, so... Don't know where your horseshoes are, mister. But that's not a lot of time. Oh, wait. I think I know what they want me to do. They want me to use that barrier to go faster. That's probably what it is. At least I think it makes me go faster. It'd be helpful if the horseshoes gave me, like, more time or something. Actually, I didn't think that really made me faster. Damn it, I thought I saw one over there. Oh my god! Wow, those enemies look kind of cool, actually. Well, it has to be within the vicinity he asked me to, right? Okay, this is harder than I thought. Man, playing this game with this controller feels natural. Oh, one over here. 
It has to be in, like, this whole room. Holy crap, he does not give you a lot of time. Oh, there's one on the couch. Okay, one more. Crap, where is the last horseshoe? Crap. Oh, right. That might be a problem. Okay, before we continue our mission, let's briefly want us some health again real quick. Like last time. We don't want a repeat of the... of the freaking elevator antic nightmare. So let's go back to Andy's house for like one second. It won't take this long this time. I promise. I'm gonna go fast. I almost have all the upgrades, so that's exciting. I watched um, one of Electric Man streams, and I, the other one is in like one of the last levels, so I'll have to wait for that one. But it'll be fun and cool to complete this game 100% if I can. I mean, it's fun. I I I think I would want to get all the collectibles. I mean, there's only five per level. And it doesn't seem overly confusing to get the objectives either. Like, Spongebob, Battle for Bikini, Kabatum, that's a fun game. I liked it a lot. There was a lot of parts where I was stumped, actually, and I didn't know how to get it. Whatever, freaking. I don't know, that game was just confusing for me. Okay, we got restocked on health, so we are going back. Pretty good pretty pleasant day overall. I think my nephew is coming over later, and, um, I'll be, um, tomorrow I'll be seeing Dragon Ball Super Superhero, so that will be Pog. My first Dragon Ball movie in theaters, so it'll be an experience. And I'll, uh, be there with my family, too, so that's awesome. Yeah. That's why I'm gonna play a Dragon Ball game soon after this, cause... Oh my god, this this song just gets me every time I hear it. It doesn't even sound like music from this game. Damn it, is the game gonna lag? Game lag issues. Okay, hold up. It's being weird. Hold up. Hold up. Ah, oh, gosh darn it. These save states are really inconsistent. Also, you probably can't hear any background noise, right? Just the game and me, I think. Okay. Hold up. Okay, we're back. It's it's running well. Did 
Oh, there's one up there. I see it. I see it now, it's always been a part of me. The endless possibilities. Got him. Okay, now I just gotta. Oh, crap. Okay, I also have the returnables like, so that's a problem. I'll just get the one near the end. Oh man, the timing on this is tight. Yeah. Here you go, bullseye. Oh, wait. No, no. The camera isn't. Oh. Oh, well, you can't hear... Uh, maybe I'll turn my mic off. You can't hear anything, though, right? I don't know. People are chattering, but it's alright. Let me just turn the decibels up a bit. Maybe. 17. Test. Test. Horseshoes. Here's your pizza planetary. I didn't hear what else he said, but whatever. Looks like a lose. I don't know. Game logic. It's like that one freaking pizza planet token you get in, um, Al's Toy Barn. Like, there's one where this guy wants, like, you to get his chick or something. And the, the, the chick is, like, time-locked to a timer for no reason. Like, nothing nothing in the game just explaining why. Just just because it's gameplay. Oh my god, that crow looks actually pretty cool. This is probably a song I'd listen to, like, unironically. Just randomly. Also, he has, like, actual snakes. In his apartment. I mean, they could be toy snakes, but they don't look like toys. Nice little setup these got here. Ow. Okay, I should not go into the fire. No, this level is actually cool. train bed if you solve the train puzzle you need to get the train to stop on the dead end track you can change the track points he's oh he has a train track that actually kind of fits the character too like i he feels like the kind of guy that would have a train set using the yellow switches i'm sorry did they spell jesse's name without an i it looks more like jess jess has lost her critters just gonna take a screenshot of this for later. She is on the kitchen table. Ooh, I know how to get the next token, Buzz. You can get to the token. Oh. No, no. I already. Ooh, I the gunslinger boss token, is in the Buzz. Woody's Roundup set in the trophy room. Oh, wait. No sneaky beat, maybe? I don't know. Actually, he might be the end boss. I'll just change the stream title to Enter Bullseye and Jesse because they're important. No, it has an eye. I thought. Alright. What is Rarin upset in the trophy room? Okay. Oh my god, why does the game keep lagging? Okay. So 
Do I need the exit again? Don't care. Let me, let me check. I am Jesse T F. Yeah, it's it's it has an I. I spelt her name wrong. I am triggered. Okay, hold up. Sorry, I was typing stuff. Oops. This thing is kind of unstable sometimes, not gonna lie. Oh, wait. No, I don't want to do that. Uh, okay. Quick downtime of the stream. Just gotta run this thing. And then this thing. Okay. Okay, run this thing, and then this thing, and then do that again, and then this. Okay, so it's only if I load the state without, like, anything else happening. Like, if I just load the first state, then it's just gonna keep crashing, but if I, if I scroll through all the states, the save states, then it's fine. Yes, of course I'll put it as a mood. That's the, that's the way. I, I consume any piece of media now. I see a thing and I'm like, wow, this could be an alias mood. Eye. <laughs> it's just the way I, 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 I do it now. I mean, honestly, it's kind of fun. It's like when I used to just play Mario games. And then I would like, hey, this is an official name for something. And then I would add it to Mario Wiki. Not too much different from that, really. It's like a database of sorts. Yes, I'm gonna. I mean, it's it's what she's called in this game. Typos are allowed as aliases. What do you mean? What do you mean next? No, oh, bro. He has a whole train room. The facets to asset to. Uh, okay, to Al's apartment, we did not see in the movie. Kinda cool. There's more I can do in this room, though, so I'm gonna look around. Nice little place he's got here, not gonna lie. I mean, he is a businessman, so... Okay, I'm sorry. Um, wait, brisket? Is that an actual spelling for Bridget? Because, I mean, I could add brisket. That's a funny one. Oh, yeah, I did add a typo for Peach's name, I believe. That was allowed, so, like... Like, typo al aliases are not, like, outlawed or anything. It just depends on what people feel like upvoting and downvoting. If people don't like it, they'll just download it, but, I mean, it's not, not allowed. Funny. Brisket. Oh, wait, that's not a real freaking typo. Dang it. That would be funny, though. If her, if her name was Brisket. 
Hey, Bridget, you wanna do a voice? I don't know. I'm trying to do, like, an Australian voice. Bruh, I gotta, like, jump across the limbs. Graphically, for a PlayStation 1 game, though, this is, like, very impressive to me. Because, like, they, they draw locations from the movie, but they still all look, like, pretty good, I would say. Oh, yo. Like, like, they look close to how it is in the movie, plus with new stuff. Like, I'm impressed. You know what? I should play that freaking Lilo and Stitch PlayStation 1 game, which is just a Crash Bandicoot clone. That'd be fun. Play Crash... Crash Lilo. Dang it. I wish Brisket was real. Sadness. Crash Lilo game. Would be fun. The game keeps, like... Randomly deciding to... Like, freeze slash crash. Hold up a second. Hold up. Okay, back again, in about time too. And this time, I'm in the mood. I can fly real high with my jetpack on. And with my pistols out, I'm one cool cop. Oh yeah, the leader of the bunch should totally be a Donkey Kong alias. I know it's somewhat generic, but like, he's the leader of the bunch. You know him well, okay? It, all of it is like. No Wait, what the hell? Oh. Okay, I'm playing the version of the game with the stereotype. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. Okay, so in later versions of this game, they 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 switch this guy with like a blonde cowboy character. Oh no. Wait, my controller is not working. They switched this guy with a blonde cowboy character, but here he's, um, this is the older version of the game, so it's a stereotype instead. Nice. The stereotype version of Toy Story 2. Oh, it's working. Okay, he shot me like once, but surely they'll have health, right? And if not, I could just save in the level. No, nope. you can't shoot me, mister. I have laser. Oh my god, I just killed that guy. You know what? Buzz the sh I didn't really think about it, but like... Aren't these like the morally correct toys? Why are they killing other people? Just like, in cold blood. Like, all these toys are dead. Okay? I don't care about your game logic slash the toys respawn etc. like stuff. Like they're just dead. Bruh, they even have the frickin' all the Woody's Roundup stuff. How do I get up there though? There has to be another way here. Am I gonna fight like duplicate buzz again? I mean other buzz again? 
Wow, it's set at nighttime? I thought it was during the day when they got here. Oh, you know what? I was hoping they'd have the freaking like, part where they... Oh, wait, never mind. I was gonna say that, um... They didn't have the part with the freaking car scene where they get in the car, but that's after they go to the apartment. I forgot. This when they're on the way to the airport. It's a cool part. Okay, I can't get up there yet. There might be another way, though. Oh, this area looks cool. Killing the cowboys. And he's finally back to kick some tail. Donkey Kong 64 stream. Everyone's favorite. This level restored some faith in the game for me. I like it a lot. But the game stopped like hanging for like two seconds. Okay, I guess it only does that occasionally. Okay, and sometimes it just crashes. When I'm trying to load a state, or save a state. Wait. Crap. You don't, don't tell me. Don't tell me that the only save state usable is broken now. Oh, great. More stream to cut out. No, at least this isn't like... I only did like a couple things in the level and that was kind of it. Kind of thing. Wait, crap. I don't want to do that. Uh, this emulator is being really annoying lately. What do you mean the safe state doesn't work now? I'm gonna beat this game no matter what, so I, I don't care. Okay, that one works. This one works. Wait. Wait. This one works. This- Holy crap, what the hell? Ah! What is this? <laughs> Um, the corrupted, the corrupted, the corrupted save state. Oh no, <laughs> the game turned into hell. I'm, I'm afraid. <laughs> I'm afraid. Okay, that state didn't work out. This one didn't work. Oh, great. So the game is just corrupt now? I mean, I could deal with it like this. What if I exit the level? What will happen? Will everything restore back to normal, as it's supposed to? I mean, it just seems like a texture slash music error, because it's like... Yeah, there's like just a buzz on the side of the screen. <laughs> what if I just save here? Will it restore to normal when I reload the level? I think it was just a loading error. I'll lose my coins, but at least I won't lose other progress. Oh, thank god. Okay, well, that's fine. I can deal with that. Plus, I could just go back to Indy's house again. Where is the menu sound effects? 
That's minor though. I don't care that the sound effects aren't loading on the menu. Yeah, they're all gone. Wait, is there any sound effects in the game? Crap, did I mess up the game? Okay, there is no sound effects. Crap. Okay. It was more severe than I thought. Well, I don't want to just... Uh... Okay, fine. I'll leave. I'll just exit the game, come back, hope that it loads it right. If not, I'll just play the whole rest of the game without sound effects at all. I guess that's a consequence of saving the game like that, but like, whatever. I thought, I thought everything, I mean, it partially restored to normal. Man, what is with the issues lately? It wasn't like this before. It was fine. I mean, I guess I didn't have to use these states as much in earlier levels, but like... Crap, I keep running the PlayStation BIOS by accident. No. This must be like a really old, like, thing. If it's like running this unstable all the time. Well, at least I know how to skip all that now. Oh, the sound effects are working. Okay, so we fixed that problem, and... Wait, I can just go straight to Emperor's Arc if I wanted to now. But, no, I, I refuse. The evil Emperor's Arc! That's cool. Okay, now I know Zerg is guaranteed for the stream. Changing the stream name again. BRB. Yeah. I mean, the Mario Kart streams at least work now. It's just kind of cursed sometimes. Oh, wait, I typed Jesse and Jesse instead of Bullseye. Whoops. You know, I, I think it's safe to say this is Showdown against Zerg. I can call the title that. It's not. Because, like, I was afraid if I put that title, I'd just be cursed again to not fight Zerg. But I won't let that happen this time. Battle against, I'll just say, battle against evil Emperor Zerg. Battle against the evil Emperor Zerg. Okay. Back. I took her to my penthouse. Or something, I don't know. Wait. The game. Okay. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. My controller is now working. That's cool. I'm okay with it. Cool. All of the issues present. Why is my controller not working? Damn it, are you kidding me? I'm not using a plate. I'm not using a freaking stupid keyboard to control this game. It just is not happening. Please. Oh my god, I hate everything. What is with this game? And being cursed. For all eternity. Also, you should clip that, um, texture load error moment. That was kind of funny. I liked that part. It was funny. 
Damn it, stop running the PlayStation BIOS. I keep misclicking. I mean, at least the music is cool, though. You gotta admit it. No, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I did it again. That's not what I want. Oh, no. Nah. Analog, I didn't even have on at the beginning. It was just the setting. It always worked because I mapped the control stick to the buttons regardless. That's the curse save. This is the good save. It works now. Yeah, you would think the analog has to do with my regular controls. Ah, dang. Oh, so you have to, like, you're... It's like clipping, like, when you're, like... Is it like 30 seconds within the moment happening or something? Cause like, I don't know how you do it when somebody's live anyway. Oh yeah, I need more health. Damn it. Damn it. Okay, fine. Okay, this... <laughs> okay, maybe I shouldn't have fast mode on. When I'm trying to do basic tasks. Like getting health. But I'm glad I found out about it. It is kind of helpful for slow parts. Made multiple saves just in case. Oh, yeah, I have to destroy that cannon again. I'll just get all these coins real quick because I need coins again anyway. It won't take me long. Also, I need to collect that critter again, too. I don't know why, but I love the design of that vulture. It looks funny. Cool. Oh, there's a piece of health right there. Good to know for later. I'm glad y'all have been enjoying this game, though. It is kind of crazy for me sometimes, that's for sure. I have a hard time with it. But when it's fun, it's fun.
This time, make a save. Be smart. What does destroying the cannon do? I guess it just helps make it not annoying. Oh, I can get through the bathroom here. Stop. You're making my stream unwatchable. Okay. Stupid lag. Okay, whatever. I'm in... Wait, is this his, like, kitchen or something? Stop. Okay. Well, Rex did say something about a vent. Yeah, I don't think I can get through here through conventional means, that's for sure. Two hours later. Oh yeah, I should use the barrier against that cowboy. He's annoying. I mean, what is this here for otherwise? Oh wait, there, there's a box here. Why wasn't I using that? Oh, it doesn't even attack them. Don't want to be in the way when my laser goes off. Okay, that audio stuttering is really annoying me. Goodbye, stereotypes. You must perish for being stereotypical. Oh, I can push it this way and get on that train. Man, this makes me wonder how good Toy Story 1 would have been if, you know, the if the PlayStation was, like, had the technology for that at the time, because, like, a 3D place, I mean, the PlayStation existed, but I don't think it was nearly as popular in 1995, so, like, a Toy Story game for it probably wouldn't have existed, unfortunately, but, like, imagine how good a to 3D Toy Story 1 game could have been if it existed. Because, like, Toy Story 2, 1, the 2D game is okay, but, like, you can see the... Uh, I, I think it's clear a 3D platformer could have been much better if the, if the technology was there at the time. 3D fits Toy Story, game, Toy Story more than 2D platformers, so that's for sure. Because, like, it's a 3D movie anyway. It makes sense. Hey, yo, I can get on top of here. Was I supposed to do that? Rex said something about the train, but I forget what he said. Oh, 
Oh, I see. The dead end. Snakes jumping into Altoya Bar and 3D Prior. True. Oh, there's a button here. Okay, I gotta make all the trucks, like, go correctly. Yeah, I probably have to find... I don't think you can get any upgrades in this level. Because the next one I need is, um... I did see, um... Electric Man Stream and, uh... It was just, um, in the airport level, I think, so... It won't be a while until I get the next one. Okay, why do I need this box? It says it, it wants me to get it to the dead end. What that end? It clearly stopped here. Maybe I'll look this one up. Yeah, I will. Train. Go to the train room. You'll find a big gun that will throw bombs at you in this area. So move constantly. Jump onto the box, then on the train, and then on the real roads. Push all the buttons to get the train to stop at the dead end. Try different combos and see the result of each one. If you get the correct combo, you will get a Pizza Planet token. Which will appear on top of the train. Okay, so I guess just mess around with it. What is the dead end it's talking about? Exactly. Is that not it right there? Or is it on the other side? Okay, it just isn't moving now, so. Yeah, that looks like a dead end to me. Where's the pizza planet token? Ah, oh, damn it. Please, stop not letting me use my PlayStation controller. Shoot. Okay, this stupid thing keeps not working. Cool. Just, just close it. Just close it again. Surely it will still work. Okay. Man, all of my streams are cursed. Yeah, I don't see why you wouldn't just use the straight path here. Hmm, maybe I have to move this one. Hmm. 
No, I don't, I don't have any idea what I'm doing. This mission's stupid. I have no idea what this box is for either. How do I make the train go? Bruh, wait, is that his bed? Okay, that's kind of adorable. Dude has a whole train themed bedroom. I need to look to this up, like, in video form. Toy Story 2 train puzzle. Oh my god, no, wait. I have to, oh my god, that Jesse model is terrifying. Okay. Oh, I see now. You need the box to get up there. To get the token to begin with. Wait, the token... Oh, I guess I already did everything I needed. I just... Did the token spawn? Or is that a, just a different token? I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, wait, I see. It wasn't getting it to the dead end that spawns the token. The token's already there, but it needs to be at the dead end in order for me to get up there. I see now. This game's puzzling me. I thought, like, like I would trigger, like, the, the thing to just appear, and I'd be like, okay, here it is. But no, it was just out in the open the whole time. Just didn't know. That was tricky. This game got me. Traveler's Tales games have a tendency to be tricky. I don't know why. I wonder if killing all those cannons will do something. Okay, well I got this room all done. I'm guessing I might need the freaking... Hover feature, jetpack thing that I get later. Wait a minute, I forgot about my grappling hook. Can I use that in the kitchen? Oh wait, no, I can't because there was no grappling hooks in this level. You have to pick it up. Over here! Damn it, I want to find at least him though. I don't want to have collected all these coins for nothing. Nothing to do in here. No, well, there is another room back here. So I don't know if I can enter it. Oh, I can. Oh yeah, I forgot about this room. But I can't really do anything in here right now either, I think. Yeah, I know, right? It has health packs, and it looks cool. Cool lag. Uh, 
I don't know. Did I corrupt the game again? Okay. Crap. Okay, that one is completely broken. Damn it. Damn it, damn it. Oh, okay. No, and the PlayStation controllers is not work. Ooh, okay, this, 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 this stream is incredibly cursed. And I can't even edit this either, because it's, like, so, like, throughout the stream. In comparison, like, I had to cut out, like, one big portion of, like, backtracking. Here, it's just while I'm playing the game now. It's so bad. But, you know, despite that, I still think I'm making good progress in the level. I just have to do that train puzzle all over again. So that's slightly annoying, but I know how to do it. Oh, no, no, no. Play One eternity later. I'm back, everyone. Let's continue the stream. No time to lose. Oh, the music's got to be turned back on. Crap, I always forget to hit X instead of cancel. Ah, oh, music's kinda loud. And one second. Hopefully this portion of the screen goes a little bit better. Oh yeah, I was gonna put the game lower. Okay. I'm more in a good headspace right now than I was before, because I was just mildly irritated at everything. For good reason, of course. But, whoa, whoa, wow, they even got, like, they got Jesse's, wait, you know, Andy has, like, the same hat. So, like, how does he even have that? I mean, I guess they made more than one, I don't know. Oh, bro, is this the boot? There's a snake in my boot. Ow. I'm trying to look at all the merchandise. Stop shooting me. It's all bit crush. I can't even see what it says. River Rescue. I could hardly even see that what that said, but... It's fine. We'll find a health packet here. Yeah, um... It might be Jesse's box. I don't know. Oh. Wait, what? Oh, okay, that's fine. I keep getting shot by those guys by accident. First order of operation, shoot these cowboys. I wonder if Pixar consulted them at all to, like, how parts of this game should be, because, like... I mean, they probably didn't get any, like, consultants or guidance from Pixar, but, like, I don't know. 
Like, imagine if Pixar helped them design, like, part of Owl's House that they, that isn't seen in the movie. Like, if they had to do that on their own, that's impressive in and of itself. But, like, I don't know. I like when the companies actually help the people making these licensed games make a good game. Because usually they don't get that kind of support. Like, for example, you know the freaking Aladdin... Super Nintendo game, that, let, or Genesis game, that's literally, the sprites in that game are, like, di by Disney animators that worked on the movie, I believe, so, like, that's really cool. Okay, whatever, it's fine, I keep forgetting the safe state, but I'm also wary of it now, so, it's understandable. I gotta find a health packet somewhere in this, this room. Maybe there's one behind this... Woody standy? No, of course, there's nothing there. Oh my god, I hate... Literally everything about this. Okay, if I'm not careful, these save states could easily kill me. And I don't want another spider situation happening here, so... Yeah. I... Uh, I wish I could see what this says. It's illegible, though. Bruh, is that frickin'... Lacro- What do you call that again? Lacrosse or something? I don't know. Wow, I can actually, like, reflect the cannon wall. Is this absolutely annoying with one health point? Yes. But I'm gonna try. Yeah, the frickin' woody teeth toy. That one's funny. Why does Al have birds throwing bombs at his house? I don't know. I think they're toys because they look, you know, cartoonish, but I'm not sure about those snakes. They don't really look to like toys to me, but I don't know. Oh, health. <laughs> I didn't know the TV sh freaking hits me. Oh, well, now I'm back to where I was before. Really? He has sparks coming out of his TV and that is... Oh, there's another critter up there. Are these toys? I think they are, but... Oh, I can go this way. Yo, I'm in a whole, like, the diorama, I think the word is. Oh, that's, bruh, look at this guy. Ha ha ha, defeat the gunslinger boss to get a pizza planet token. Okay, that is a gunslinger. Am I gonna be able to beat him though? Yes. Compared to Spider, you are nothing. I will kill you, gunslinger. This town ain't big enough for the two of us. Honey bubble blower. 
I love it too. I wish they made all those all into like real things you can get. Cause like they're all fun. Top 10 epic battles. Okay, this is a little harder than I thought, but I have a couple health points. Okay, that's not a good idea. Ah, Frank, okay. I hate everything. Oh my god. Oh, okay. I thought I just messed everything up. See, this is why I make multiple saves. One of them can easily screw up on you. Okay. Dude can shoot cannonballs from his gun. That doesn't look like a bullet. That just looks like a cannon. Also, this is, like, mad easy. He's dead. Oh my god, he's just on the floor and dead. Also, yeah, new new OC here. I I just killed him. Goodbye, gunslinger. Maybe that's one of the villains that they mentioned in the Rudy's Roundup opening, because like. Because they, they say bad guys go running, but we don't actually see any villains in the show. So, you know, it's implied. You know, there's an implication there. That there is bad guys. Bad guys go running. Whenever he's in town, he's the rootinest, tootinest, suitinest bad... Cowboy around, Woody, he's round up. Okay, that was careless of me. You don't want to be in the way when my laser goes off. You don't want to be in the way when my laser goes off. Okay, now what do I do? I went up on that shelf and I pretty much got everything in this room, I think. Maybe I do need the hover collectible. And I can't even get the ham yet. Possibly. I don't know. I'll, I'll talk to um, Rex again. I forget what he said about ham. You can reach the bathroom through a hidden vent. Look out for any locks that you can shoot. Well, I don't know where the bathroom is. So that's the problem. Hidden locks that I can shoot? Where is Al's bathroom? This room, this bedroom is right here. His storage room is over here. The bathroom must be next to that kitchen, but I don't know how to get to it. It must be that barred off door right here. Why he has the vent open here, I don't know. It's beyond my comprehension. Wait. Okay, apparently Jesse is already friends with me.
And apparently Jessie is already my friend because she's saying, Over here, Buzz! Just like any other character in this game. It said, look for any locks. Oh, thank God. Health. No time to lose. Over here, bud. Well, they actually got the voice actor from the movie. Okay, there's, there is no way to get up here. There is zero way to get up here. Over here, bud. You need the hover. Damn it. Do I need to get the hover and then come back here and then get all those coins again? Because, like, it'd be nice to know. Wait, what? What about this fire? It's clear it wants me to do something with it. Wait a minute. I am a genius. That barrier at the beginning of level. I. No. I don't even need you. Okay, now I know what to do with this thing. It just hit me. I could use this to get into that fire, and then I don't know what's next after that, but... Extra lives exist! Oh yeah, he... He does do... I think he says that. They must be really rare in this game. But hey, at least I'm less screwed if I die now. Ham is in the bathroom. You can reach it. Vent locks. I don't see vent locks. Lost her critters. Okay, those are like the last things I need to do. But I don't, I don't see these vent locks. That's the problem. Do I need to shoot something? Maybe there's like something out of my like line of vision that I need to look for. I mean, he did tell me to look for the vent locks. Oh, wait. I'm s Oh, okay. I thought he meant, like, actual vents. Like, I was thinking, like, you know, like, like when we were in the freaking elevator. Like, I had to find another vent. And then go through, like, part of the house. And then I'll just find an opening to get into the bathroom. But no. By vent locks, he just meant, like, a freaking lock on the fridge. Which, by the way, I don't know why Al would need, but apparently people come in and steal his fridge at night, so. Okay, we're making progress on this level, guys. Finally. And everything's working mostly smoothly. Also, apparently the stove is left on. That's very safe. What is this, and why is it so bouncy? Damn cannons! This is just this level's version of the annoying laser section at, um, else Space Land. Oh, I got my 50 coins. Oh, yo, I'm actually sliding on these. Uh, I gotta go on top of the fridge. There's probably something there. Yo. Mad platforming. Where is Ham? Oh yeah, he said he was in the bathroom. Duh. Where's Jesse? Oh. 
I see. I didn't see where Jesse was. Uh, that is a very interesting looking model. Howdy, Buzz! All my critters have escaped. You can find all five. I can't. I can't speak in Jessie's accent. She has a very distinct voice in the movie, not like a typical Southern accent. Let me come and see me. I'll give you a Pizza Planet token. Well, I only need one more critter, so. Okay. Howdy. Yeah, I just need to find where that um. They said something about vent locks, right? Is there locks? Is there any other locks I have to look for? Hidden vent? No, he did say. Look, oh wait, no. I'm... Okay, I like mixed what he said together. Look for, for any locks that you can shoot. I only saw one on the fridge, but there could be more. Where is the locks? Bruh, is that like beer? Dude has this tons of booze. I don't know what the stuff at the top is. Over here. You know, I wonder how the Buzz Lightyear of Star Command game is. That, that, that's a game, too. That show had a game. I should play that. I wonder if it plays anything like this. I mean, that game's also Traveler's Tales. I bet it's like an underrated classic type sequel to this game, in a way. It probably has the same engine. It's probably like Battle for Bikini Bottom. Battle for Bikini Bottom and frickin', um, what's it? The SpongeBob movie game. Like, they're not... They have nothing to do with each other, like, plot-wise, but their gameplay is the same, so it's basically a sequel to Battle for Bikini Bottom. Like, they got the same engine. There has to be a lock somewhere, right? I don't- I didn't see a vent. Did you guys see anything? Uh, yeah. Oh, wait, is it different from this game? No. Oh, yeah, I bet Andrew had uh, very good things to say about the first Toy Story game. That's for sure. Unfortunately, one of these Toy Story games is lost, I think. And I don't know if you can emulate it either. Freaking Toy Story 3 for the Sega Pico Bino. Sega like Pico Bino or something like that. Found out about it on Sega Retro and I, I couldn't find anything about it online other than a trailer, so. It's a lost media search I'm willing to, like, tell people about, but I don't know if it'll be findable by any mm, casual means. Okay, I'm gonna look at this up. Destroy the lock. Wait. I had to go to the fireplace. Oh, I didn't even see that.
I bet he had good things to say about this one, right? Oh, what the? How did I not see that in the whole level? I am silly. Oh, okay, that's one way to get to the bathroom. Yo, his bathroom is huge. What the heck? I've never seen such a big bathroom in my life. This is like half of a kitchen. The size of this bathroom. Why is it so big? Getting vibes of the one Toy Story 3 breakout scene with Woody. He just go he just breaks out through the bathroom. There you go, Buzzy Boy. Raise and lower the water level. The button in the bottom of the tub will drain all the water. The other buttons will raise the water to the level. Okay, why does he have buttons? This logically doesn't make sense. Why, why does it fill the whole room? What the hell? Okay, this is this Mario 64. <laughs> We're in wet and dry land. Mini wet and dry land, boys. Also, his whole bathroom fills with water, because I don't know. What dry land but Good. Everything's right next to each other, so the water gimmick isn't as annoying. What dry world slash, um, lost world from Sonic Adventure? The one part of the level, anyway. Mad Fantasia vibes. Dun dun da 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 dun 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 How is his battery not shorting out? By the way, I didn't really like Dream Drop a ton at first, but I started to gain a more of an appreciation for it as I played. What am I supposed to do now? I can't reach that, can I? Oh, no I can. Go ahead. Destroy that cannon. The way that it uses the water raising is actually kind of cool, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, the music has like no loop. It's probably the same way in other levels of the game too, I just didn't notice honestly. Are you kidding me? Oh gosh, one second.
um, the freaking Kingdom Hearts Dream Shop game. I mean, I mean, it's okay at first, but like the other levels later in the game are kind of cool actually. I like the, I like the Country of the Musketeers for some reason, and like the Fantasia level is really cool. Oh, I think I got all the tokens here. Okay, apparently, even though the vent's open, this has no effect on the rest of Al's house. Let's go, we're making smooth progress here, finally. We had a rough start, but now I figured it out, deleted the safe states, everything's working. Oh wait, wrong way. Wait, where am I going actually? All right, right here. Over here. Why am I helping her? Doesn't she hate me right now? Her face is kind of creepy, not gonna lie. Yeah, definitely. Let's go, we beat the level. Now we can fight Zerg. Finally. How long was my last stream, anyway? Actually, I think I'll um, head off for today, but we'll start Zerg next time, and then we'll do other stuff. So, um, have a good one, everybody, and take care.